Hey there guys and welcome to the iWeb Wednesday tutorial. Today we're showing you guys something that I think you'll like a lot and that's how to make money using advertisements on a website that you can create in uh, iWeb or any other website creation software. Um, before we get too far along, I'm just going to jump right in, shall we? I don't really have anything else to say, so let's go! Alright, so before we get too far along, I'm just going to say that Google AdSense is definitely the best advertising um, service out there. Um, one re one obvious reason is just because it's managed by Google, which is you know probably one of the biggest companies on the internet, if not the biggest. Um, you know they make Google or Google makes YouTube, they make MySpace, they have just they manage so much stuff. It's it's insane. So um, Google AdSense is definitely I say the way to go, and it's super easy in iWeb. Um, there should be a little button down in your right um, left bottom right um, called Show Media click that button um, or click it again to hide it but it's going to come up with this little menu right here and to the far right is a widgets button and there's going to be a button for uh, a widget excuse me for Google AdSense and as we can see it says Google AdSense live ads will appear on your published um, publish page and you just got to drop that in and it's that simple obviously you got to sign up for an account which um, most of these will require a social security number of some sort as well as a banking a bank, um, a bank number, I, I believe, um, or they can write you a check or something like that. I don't know. A lot. Of, um, they different. They vary from um, provider to provider of ads. Uh, all the um, ads on Google, those all work off of Google AdSense. Um, a lot of the very big companies and or the big web pages out there, they all use Google AdSense. I don't have a Google AdSense, and I'm not. Uh, so I apologize. I'm not going to show you guys like step by step how to sign up. But I'm sure you guys can probably find a way around. So I'm just going to hit cancel. Um, I, on the other hand, use a program called AdBright, which is a really um, great um, ad provider. Um, and it's really straightforward and it's simple. And um, I'm going to give you a quick rundown. Um, here's pretty much what it looks like um, once you sign up. Uh, I'm not going to guarantee you guys to be the next Shane Doss and to make millions of dollars um, or whatever. I don't even know how much he makes, but. He makes a lot using these advertisements. As you can see, ever since the summer, I've only made ten dollars and thirty-seven cents, which is practically, you know, nothing. <laughs> it's almost nothing. I'm just gonna say that. So, um, it's definitely not like the advertising service. It just my well, my website isn't all that popular. But if yours is very popular, then definitely go with AdBright or Google AdSense. Or any of the uh, others that are in the link in the, uh, the links in the description. I don't know if I said that in the intro, but all the links for the, these advertisement uh, these advertisement providers, all the all their uh, websites are in the description. So after that, you um, usually these are gonna have a button called Manage Ad Zones, which is pretty much where you manage um, your ads. <laughs> as weird as that sounds, well, not really weird, but obvious. Um, here it usually shows you like how many people view it um, within a time period like seven days past 30 or all time um, shows you the name where it's located and stuff like that and now here's a little tip for you guys um, AdSense does not allow you to have multiple ads on a single web page if you do not have a very popular website um, back when I back when I first started um, Google or not Google AdSense but uh, AdBright, they I only had one one ad on the web page and it was right down here, which um, I, I was kind of sad about. I was like, oh, oh well. Um, but here's a little trick for you guys: if you have um, if, if that happens to you and it says like we cannot approve this ad or whatever, here's something that you can do: take it, hit con Command V and um, com or yeah, Command C and Command V, which will pretty much just make a um, a duplicate. It's gonna copy and paste that ad. And this is really great because it means there's more money coming into your pocket, um, and it's just going through a single ad. Unlike beforehand when you had like multiple ads or something and a lot of different ad zones to manage. Over uh, here, if you see like there's like the bottom banner ad, top of the welcome page, stuff like that. Um, it's all just like going through one. It's like here, these two ads are going through one of these, which. You know, it's probably not that hard of a concept to understand, but it's definitely a very useful trick. So keep that in mind. 
and then you know you know I just copy and paste those to like, over um, different um, pages of your website. Like here, I've got two more, and it's just pretty neat stuff. So just keep that in mind. Um, I hope this tutorial was useful. I will be making a Final Cut tutorial on Friday. I still have no idea what I'm going to do yet, though. <laughs> if you have any recommendations for what I should do for Friday's Final Cut tutorial, leave a comment down below. But on that note, I will see you guys, and please subscribe. Um, check out our Facebook, um, our Facebook page and our Twitter link. Those are both in the sidebar. Or, you know, just have, I don't know, <laughs> that's actually all I had to say. Um, I hope you guys all have a wonderful day, and I will see you on Friday with a Final Cut tutorial. Until then, um, see you guys.